Leverader against Reese in the center to jump, and the opening tap is controlled by the LSU Tigers. Quickly in the front court is Flaugé Johnson, the freshman with the basketball right side. Kentucky opens up in a 2-3 zone. They go left side to Alexis Morris. Morris penetrates to about 10 feet. Of course, the jumper no good, and a foul on Blair Green. Great at shooting their free throws. As a team, just 66%. But they want to get to the line where Morris misses the first one, no good. We welcome you into Rupp Arena inside Central Bank Center. I'm Darren Hedrick with you. First, second free throw is good. Sheer at the center circle. Right hand dribble, picks it up, comes to Leveretter high on the wing. Underneath now to Robin Bitt. She's covered up by three LSU defenders as the ball knocked away and it's stolen. Ripped out of there by LSU's Carson. Pass ahead to Reese. Reese drives Green on the baseline, stops in the low post, gives it to Johnson flying down the lane wide open for a layup, and it's 3-0 LSU. Cats have already turned it over and given up points on the other end. That's been a bugaboo for this offense in the last few games. Leveretter in the lane throws up a wild shot that's no good. Here come the LSU Tigers off the rebound the other way. Morris, entry pass. Comes on the left side to Reese. She backs down into the paint. Right hand baby hook good for Reese. <laughs> Kentucky attacks the rim to your left as you listen on radio. Here's Walker driving into the low post. Off the window, Walker scores. The sophomore out of Richmond, Virginia, averaging 13 a game, gets her first bucket, and it's 5-2 LSU. Carson's got it on the right wing for the Tigers. High pass into the low post to Reese on the right side. Reese spins, has her layup attempt hit the bottom of the rim. A graduate senior out of Brampton, Ontario, 6-2 forward. Again, Reese in the low post, fires up a pass that misses everything, but is fouled, and I think that's on Leveretter. Angel Reese at the line, the 6'3 sophomore out of Baltimore, Maryland, who is an outstanding player. She leads the nation in scoring at 24 points a game as she sinks the free throw and is sixth in the nation. Actually, she's sixth in scoring, beg your pardon. Leads the nation in rebounding at over 15 boards a game. Adieye looks to give it to Walker, finally does near the top of the key. Walker drives towards the free throw line, now curls out. Walker again picks up the drive down the left side, back out to Adieye, nine to shoot. Here's Benton now. Benton gets away possibly with a push off. Air balls an 18-footer off the right side. And so it's Kentucky ball as LSU tipped the shot from Benton. Here's Benton off the inbounds, left wing, turn around. Three ball is good for Robin Benton. Her first bucket of the day, and it's 7 to 5 LSU. Nearly three minutes have gone here in the first quarter. Tigers on the attack. Right side Carson. Down low to Reese. Outside the lane. Reese comes into the paint as double team throws up the shot off the glass and scores. Wildcats have the ball in half court. LSU went for the steal. That leaves Benton open. A three is no good. And the rebound controlled by LSU. <laughs> LSU gets it across half court easily. Here's Johnson driving all the way to the rim and scoring. 15 to shoot. Here's Benton. Free throw line to Walker above the yard. Walker at the top of the key tries to move right. Runs into about three or four LSU Tigers and turned it over on the run out. Here's Williams down the left side. Williams to the basket. Scores. Wildcats never got in front of the ball off the turnover. LSU's already up to seven points off Kentucky miscues. Cambridge has it top of the key. The freshman out of Nashville, Tennessee, comes right to Shear. Shot clock at 10. Here's Walker. Didn't take the open three from the right wing. Instead, pump fakes, drives in, misses the short baseline jumper, and the rebound is out on the end line to LSU. Freshman on freshman against Cambridge. Johnson comes into the low post and feeds it to Williams, who missed the layup. Reese has got the rebound on the other side. She's double teamed, pushed out of bounds, and the loose ball picked up by Cambridge. Kennedy skips it to Shear, back to Cambridge. The open 17-footer is no good. Rebound, Leveretter powers up, scores, and is fouled. So here's Leveretter at the line shooting two. First one, well, actually the and one, I should say, and she missed it. Now picks up the dribble. She hustles to the center circle, takes Walker to the free throw line, down low to LaDasia Williams, out to Johnson on the right wing. 15 to shoot for LSU. Here's Johnson driving to the basket, and she got fouled by Adieye. But she always lowers those arms when trying to block a shot, and that's going to get called every time. So here's LSU at the line. It's Johnson shooting. LSU has already attempted five free throws, and they've made four. Gunning for a fifth make. She got it. Former LSU Tiger, Petty, a 6'3", junior out of Baltimore, averaging seven points and six rebounds. Walker 
in the front court. Slices right, comes off to Shear in the right corner. Maddie comes to the free throw line, pull up jumper, no good. Rebound, Cambridge goes after Reese for it. At the Shear, left wing three is good. Kateri Poole off the right baseline near the basket. Quick inbounds to Morris, right corner. They work it to Ladasia Williams down low. Spinning shot in the paint is no good at the horn. 15 to shoot. Walker gets the screen by Leveretter. Walker driving left. No, she can't shoot over at Williams. Comes back out to Shear. Now to Cambridge right wing. Shot clock at seven. Cambridge backing away from the rim. Four seconds. Cambridge drives. Cambridge up and under move. Got it to go. LSU's got it. 35 seconds left. Here's a lob on the right to Poa. Poa takes Amia Jenkins into the lane with a Euro step. She walked, sliding that pivot foot. Shearer moves right towards the free throw line, comes back to Jenkins' left wing. Jenkins drives back to Green, left wing, open three ball is no good. Rebound Reese and a foul on the Wildcats. Reese two for two on her free throws early. Wildcats hanging tough in this first quarter. Second free throw is good. Six seconds left. Wildcats need to hurry to get the shot. They get it to Jenkins. Jenkins got to go. Four seconds, three seconds. Amia crosses half court. Amia down the left side. Runner off the window is no good at the end of the first quarter. Wildcats in a battle right now against undefeated and number seven LSU. Wildcats were in a 2-3 zone to start the game. It appears currently they're man-to-man. Here's Johnson, or Morris rather, to the free throw line. Missed the jumper, and Williams goes over the back of Blair Green. Sheer between the circles. Skips it to Bitten on the left. Bitten, free throw line. Thought about the pull-up jumper. Now fires and gets it to fall in off the back iron. Bitten up to five points. Kentucky down three. Pool down low to Reese. Reese open, right side layup, good. Leveretter was fronting her, so they lobbed that pass down there, and that once Reese got a hold of it, she was behind Leveretter. Here's Shear, a transition three on the left side that goes. Maddie Shear with her second three ball. Back come the Tigers now. Johnson weaves her way up the far sideline. Johnson down the lane, Euro steps and scores. Cambridge to toss it in, face guarded to her right by Poa. They come to Benton right corner. Turnaround 19-footer is no good. Adeyeye had the rebound, hit her in the head, and it bounces to Poole of LSU. Poole in the front court, comes right to Poa. 4.17 to go until halftime. Johnson takes it left wing, guarded by Walker. Johnson takes off to the left, down towards the baseline, pulls up from 10 and scores. Johnson now with 10 points to lead LSU, and it's 23-17. Tigers have opened up a six-point advantage. Their largest lead of this half has been eight points. They've been there twice. Kentucky's cut it to single digits. Here's Benton off the left wing. A three ball is no good. And rebound to pool for LSU. Cats haven't scored in over two minutes. LSU leads by six. Here's Poa going down low to Reese, and she's held by Adieye. Poa from the left baseline under the basket. Lob to Reese near the free throw line. She collects it over Leveretter. Reese having trouble with the dribble, picks it up, throws a right-hand hook off the side of the glass. No good, but Johnson's there for the rebound, and she puts it up and in. 12 for Johnson, and now Kentucky turns it over in the backcourt. They're going to say that a tip pass came off of the Wildcats on the sideline. We saw that out of Coach Mulkey's teams when she was at Baylor and obviously in her time here at LSU. Inbounds comes quickly to Poa out of the timeout. Poole takes it top of the circle. Poole drives the left side, runs over Cambridge and scores. Cambridge got off balance that time, but it didn't take much for uh, Poole to basically run her over, and it's 27 to 17, LSU by 10. That's a nice move by Poole down low. Green at the top of the circle, comes right to Shear. 15 on the shot clock, Shear. Top of the circle, driving left, lost the ball in traffic. Johnson with a steal. LSU's got a three on one break. Johnson to the basket, scores. And it's 29 17 in the blink of an eye. Kentucky was within four, and now all of a sudden they find themselves down 12. They need to score badly. 2.38 to go in the half. Here's Kennedy Cambridge near the free throw line extended. Comes to Benton on the left wing. Benton into the lane, has her right hand hook blocked away by a bevy of LSU arms. Here's Johnson on the run out off the loose ball. Johnson then tied up by Shear, and it will stay with LSU. LSU off the baseline, gets it in to Reese in the high post. 
Reese comes down inside, left-hander no good. Rebound on the other side by Smith, who scores over Green. And a timeout by the Wildcats. Shear into front court, moves left off the Leverator screen. 15-footer partially blocked. Loose ball is taken by Poole and a timeout by LSU. It's currently a 14-3 run that's lasted five and a half minutes, and it could last as many as six. LSU can basically hold for the last shot if they want to. Poole's got it in the center circle against Amiya Jenkins. Jenkins trying to steal it away from Poole, but Poole using her back to the guard to protect the left-hand dribble. Ten seconds to go on the shot clock. Poole comes left to Poa. She's double teamed on the wing. Back to Poole. Poole shovels it underneath to Smith. Smith has her shot blocked by Petty. It's out of bounds to LSU with three seconds to go. That post area, the paint area, that's where they're going to get it. They tried to go to Reese. It's at her feet, and Reese did not get a shot off. <laughs> and our PA guy, the mayor, with the uh, de declaration of halftime, a little eight-tenths of a second too early. Walker's three-quarter court shot is no good, and that's the half. Walker getting loose, lost the ball in traffic, picked up by Johnson, credit her with a steal. Johnson the other way, got the runner to go in transition. LSU had a three-on-one breakaway off the steal. That's 13 Kentucky turnovers, 12 LSU points. Bitten at the free throw line, gives to Leveretter down low, and Naya's foul trying to score. And for the season, Leveretter's three out of five, limited opportunity. Got a second attempt coming up. And missed it long, but Shear grabs the board for Kentucky. Double team, Shear gets loose and scores somehow. Poole, top of the circle against the 2-3 zone. They go right to Carson in the corner to Reese. Reese lobs it up for Poole, left side. Now they come off to Johnson. Johnson in the lane, gets fouled, and the shot rolls away. Free throws for the freshman Johnson, who came in averaging almost 14 points a game. She's up to 16 with four rebounds. Second attempt, got it. Shear into front court, comes down to the left wing, stops, now pivots right to green. A three in the air is off the mark. Rebound Johnson. Johnson then gets tripped up, a blocking foul on Leveretter along the baseline. Jada Walker still trying to get the defensive call as Poole's bringing it up behind her. They come to Carson on the right wing. Shown the trap for a moment, now they back away. Carson still with the basketball, lobs it to Reese in the left post. Reese powers up, missed the layup, grabbed her own rebound and scored. Couldn't box her out, and she is the tallest player in that low post area. And it's 37-22, LSU back up to a 15-point advantage. Here's Benton, free throw line off to sheer left side. Maddie drives through the contact, gets the runner to go down the left side. Maddie Shear stepping up offensively for Kentucky. She has 10 points on four of nine shooting. 37-24, left side Carson jacks a three, no. Rebound, Shear had it, ripped away by LSU. The putback's no good. Reese grabs this one and is fouled by Adieye. Reese is four for four today, and she hits the first one. 37-24 Tigers. Second attempt, good. Shear crosses half court at the center circle. Right side high to Adieye. Now they come to Benton, free throw line. Benton triggers, got it. High of the arc, pool across the top of the key, right side Poa, she pump fakes, drives the entire arena screaming walk, and a runner's no good by LSU, and a foul as Adeyeye got the rebound. LSU 11 out of 12 on their charity tosses today. Williams' first attempt of the afternoon is short. She's on her third SEC school. Williams' second free throw missed long, and that means free Chick-fil-A for the fans here at Rupp Arena. Big Blue Nation cheering loud for a free biscuit. Into front court off the rebound comes Kentucky. Walker hands it off to Shear right wing. They swing it to Benton near the free throw line. Benton backs out now. LSU appears to be in a zone defensively. For a sagging man one. Here's Walker off the right side. Left to Benton. 
Lob to Petty in the high post. Petty backs down on Reese, and Reese blocked the shot. Petty got the loose ball. Shot clock violation on the Wildcats. They walk the dribble into front court, center of the floor. Poa, or a bigger pardon, Johnson flanks to the right. Poa picks up the dribble, driving left. Now spins back to Johnson on the right wing, underneath the Reese, and a double team, and a reach-in foul is called on the Wildcats. So you've got Anaya Russell in there to relieve Maddie Shear for a minute with 14 point, uh, 13 points in the game. Her 14th point is good. Away to Robin Benton, far sideline, into front court. Robin to the top of the key, drives, tried to go underneath the Adeyeye, who wasn't ready for the pass. 3.45 to play in the period. Boa backs out to the center circle. Brings the dribble to the right on a pass to Poole. Right corner, here's Johnson for three. Good, LSU's first triple of the day. They're now one for six, and the Tigers go up 44-26. Their biggest advantage of the afternoon. 3.20 to play. Russell, low post, dribbles into a double team, lost control of it, dribbled it on the baseline, and turned it over. Poa with the basketball, crosses half court, moving left. Not seen much of Alexis Morris for the Tigers here in the second half. Poole in the right corner, brings it back out towards the top of the circle with a lob to Poa left wing. Poa, left corner, Johnson open again, a three is good. Russell resets the play left wing, under 10 to shoot. Left corner's Addy AA. Addy to the free throw line, lost the ball, she got fouled. Kentucky's won three of the last five in the series with LSU. First free throw for Addy is no good. And LSU has won both of those meetings. The last one came in 2018 when the Tigers escaped with a 72-70 final. Addy Aye misses both free throws. Angel Reese collects the rebound, and LSU goes to work with a 21-point lead. 2-18 to play in the third. Poa hands, get, takes a tough handoff from Reese out high on the right side of the floor in half court. Shot clock down to 10 for the Tigers. Here's Poole right wing. Free throw line to Williams. Down low to Reese and she's fouled. So here's Angel Reese back to the line where she's a perfect 8 for 8 today and misses that one. She's got 14 points and 9 rebounds. Second attempt is good. Into front court, Shear with a right hand dribble, takes off down the left, shovels it to Russell on the left wing. 150 to play in the third. Russell, free throw line, pull up jumper, no, rebound Williams for LSU. Angel Reese under the basket left side, comes in the corner to Poa, still on the left wing. Now back to Reese in the low post, and Reese muscles Leveretter away from the basket and draws the foul. It's exactly what Coach Mulkey's squad wants to do. They want to really pound the ball inside and get the opponent in foul trouble. Ten more free throws than their opponent entering today. Second free throw's good. Green, right wing, was going to hand it off to Benton, but Robin was cutting the baseline. They come to Shear. now high post to Petty. Petty then, well, there's a push off. First free throw attempt is good. Second free throw is way long, and the rebound controlled by Reese, who somehow kept it in bounds on the baseline. LSU flips it to Poa up the near sideline. She'll weave towards the right side of the center circle. 27 seconds to go in the quarter. There is a, we'll call it six second difference between the game clock and the shot clock. Shear and Poa battle it between the circles. Eight to shoot. Here's Poa taking off down the left side against Shear. Shear walled her up, and that's a foul. Poa to shoot two. First one is up and good. Second attempt is good. Final 10 seconds. Here's Shear into front court left wing. Hand off to Benton. Benton scrambles around to Shear in the left corner. She drives baseline, but apparently stepped out of bounds before taking off. And Kentucky turns it over for the 17th time. Long inbounds comes to Angel Reese in the half court. Three seconds, Reese down the right side, scores with barely a second left. The clock expires, and LSU converts a perfect full court play with four seconds left in the quarter. LSU will start the fourth quarter with possession. Poa between the circles, drives right, goes down the lane against Walker and scores. Left to right come the Cats. Walker crosses over the free throw line. 
Comes back to green right wing to Petty on the right block. Petty from the right block. Gives it to Walker in the high post. Walker runs over Poa, no whistle, and Walker scores. 56-29, Jada Walker now with four points. She's two of nine from the floor. Walker guarding Poa in the backcourt. She crosses half court at the center circle. 7.38 to play. Right side pass to Johnson. Johnson started to penetrate the wing, now comes back to the top of the key, pulls up from 19 and hits it. an out front shot. Johnson with 26 points for LSU today. An outstanding freshman. Here's Walker the other way, and this time she's called for the offensive foul. Flaget Johnson, though, the freshman out of Savannah, Georgia. She's been a three-time SEC Freshman of the Week. Had an outstanding game at Texas A&M with 18 points, five rebounds, and three steals. She has 26 points and seven rebounds today. She brings it out to Shear on the right wing. Back to Cambridge left side. Cambridge comes towards the corner to Green. Entry pass to Petty in the low post. Petty spinning away. Reese trying to block the shot, but Petty's able to lay it up and in. That was over. Samaya, uh, Samaya Smith was down there as well. 58-31, to 31, LSU by 17. Here's Reese giving it to Smith in transition, and she traveled under the basket on a spin move in the low post. Cambridge to throw it in. She's under the goal. Comes to Shear, short corner jumper, no good for Shear. And we got a foul against Kentucky on the rebound. LSU's turned it over four times in the last three minutes, but they lead by seven, uh, by 27, and now we've got a whistle and a foul in the backcourt. This one's on Walker. So three fouls on Walker, three on Kentucky. One of the officials and head coach Kyra Elsey, and now they're going to beckon both teams to the bench. And they're going to take a look on the monitor. So an intentional foul issued on Poa of LSU. Sheer at the line, shooting two uncontested free throws, makes the first. Maddie up to 11 points for the game. She makes both free throws. Reese off the right baseline, gives it to Poa. Poa comes back to Reese. She's one-on-one -on -one with Leveretter, and the layup is no good. Long rebound comes out to Walker of Kentucky. Jada comes across the free throw line out to Shear left side. Maddie gets to the baseline. LSU catches up. High post, it comes to Petty. Down low in a double team. Petty throws it out, throws it away to Johnson. Johnson ahead to pull. LSU back the other way right to left. Pool runs over Walker. And a blocking foul on Jada. And here's Poole at the line shooting two. She is four for four on the season at the line. Entering today, she goes two for two here and is six for six now. Maddie in the front court hustling to the right. Hand off to Benton, open three. Good for Robin Benton off the right side. Benton up to 12 points. She's got two threes today. Robin came in averaging 19 over the last seven games. And here's Reese driving the left baseline. Missed the layup and takes the rebound away from Addie Yeye, who then fouls Reese, and Addie just fouled out of the game. She's on pace to do that again today. And she needs a free throw for 20 points, and she gets it with the first try. Second attempt, good. She scored 13 points at the charity stripe this afternoon. Cambridge comes up the near sideline, stops near the free throw line extended, finds Shear left wing, bottom. Three ball by Maddie Shear off the left side. She has 15, third three-pointer of the afternoon. 62 to 38, LSU leads. And now Poa has the dribble knocked away by Benton from behind. Shear picks it up. Shear Euros to the basket and scores a runner. 62 to 40, the Wildcats throws it long to Reese behind the defense, but too far, and it's out of bounds. Last touched by Reese on the end line. Kennedy Cambridge, she's going to be pretty good for the next few years. Here's Shear down the left side, gets stopped in the high post, out to Green for a long three, and that's good. Blair Green finally gets one to go. And LSU comes up with a loose ball. Reese in the front court, just got away with a carry and now whistle and a foul on Kentucky. Only uh, 13 rebounds, but she is at 21 points. Second free throw is good. The official tally says 42. 
Here's Cambridge, top of the circle for the Wildcats in the half court, 123 to go. Shear against Morris, gets down to the baseline, pull up 15, footer is good for Maddie Shear off the right baseline. She has 19, and it's 64-44. And now Kentucky trapping Morris in the backcourt, and they call a foul on Cambridge. She's one out of two at the line. LSU will attempt 30 free throws before this game is over. First one here is no good for Morris. That's one way to win a ball game, outscore a team 24 to four at the charity stripe. And Morris misses both, rebound Leveretter, clears it away to Shear, far sideline to Russell. Russell into the lane, gets fouled with 102 to play. Shear lobs it to Russell, left side. Russell spins into a triple team, falling down, whistled for the travel. Poole lobs it in to Reese out of the timeout. Reese in the high post, free throw line extended. Throws it back out to Poole, now to Morris. They'll run some clock here. Morris near the center circle, holds the ball. Down to 45 seconds to go in the game. Now she lost the dribble on her own without pressure. Cambridge pursuing. Morris picks it up. Moves right. Nine seconds to go. Morris into the lane to Reese. The runner's good, and a foul is called, and Kennedy Cambridge is down on the floor. And Cambridge sits up as some of the LSU players come out to check on Kennedy. Great sign here. She is walking towards the bench. Second, or the uh, free throw, the and one for Reese is good, and she'll tag out as Samaya Smith returns. 67 to 44, LSU, final 33 seconds. Walker in the front court, hands off to Shear. She lets fly a three and hits. Maddie Shear with 22 points for the Wildcats this afternoon. She's made four threes. So LSU's going to try to throw this in here with the shot clock off, 28 seconds to go. Kentucky double teams, Russell and Poole tie up, and the alternating possession stays with LSU. Johnson from the right baseline, throws it long for Poole. She's got it, and LSU's got to play keep away here for 20 seconds. Kentucky's not going to foul, but they are going to try to create a turnover if they can. Now they're down to 15 seconds. Coach Elsie trying to get her team to defend here. LSU's not looking to shoot the ball. They're looking to wind this thing down. LSU will improve to 16-0 on the season, 4-0 in the SEC. The Wildcats have now lost 7 of 8. They fall to 500 at 8 and 8 and are 0 and 4 in conference play. Tough one here today at Rupp Arena for the Wildcats. LSU wins it 67 to 48, the final score. Coming up, Wildcat wrap up here on the UK Sports Network.